Good morning, ECN Trade Technical Webinar. My name is Rob Clayton. The Australian dollar still remains in a negative formation, seen from the dailies. And also, if we look towards the shorter term hours, is that we're looking for a further rollover here in the stochastic, which eventually will bring the target towards 74.40 and with the objective, as I, as I noted, at 73.5. Any fresh attempts, like previously, should fail towards the resistance of 74.90. With above that, a firmer resistance around about 75.20 to 30. Do note that we see a break beneath 73.5 would expose the next target, which holds towards 72.50.70, which is what I'm in favour of seeing, especially when you look at these uh, indicators and how weak the Aussie should eventually um, progress should bring those targets eventually in sight. The, um, the euro dollar still looks destined for that challenge at 109.50. A break beneath there would expose the next target of 107.40.70. On the day however any fresh attempts towards the upside should be contained by the resistance around about 110.10 to 110.60, which is um, pretty much where these highs are that failed recently. Well, Donnie Yen, since the uh, bearish outside range day, is now going back to re-challenge this break level of 105.40. And as you can see here on a daily with the outside range day and a negative indicator coming through here, could actually see that level break and then look towards the next target, which holds around 103.60, or maybe lower to 103.20. And as you can see here, the weakness coming through now, we're not far away from this target, 105.50, as it challenges it pretty much uh, in the next probably few minutes. But do note that we do see a break of 105.40, does reveal the next downside target. Sterling also posts an outside range day and remains weak. On the day I'm looking for the challenge of 130.70 to support and then lower down towards 130.20.25. In light of the recent weakness in the outside range day, we could now see a potential target of 127 coming through in the next few days. Any attempts towards the upside should find resistance now around 131.65 on the day. Gold still pretty much remains weak. It did break through that 1,318 level. I'm still looking for a downward challenge to, to this bullish camp around 1,300. The, bear, the bears would need to break through that level to get the next move down towards 1,280. If the bulls don't defend that level, then we will see that, that come through very quickly, I would imagine, with stops likely to build in underneath this level. However, a rejection should see a rally back towards 1,349. I'm in favour to see this uh, bounce from this level, but do note if, they, if the stops are triggered underneath that level, then we should see, as I say, 1,280 come through very quickly. And to wrap up with oil, well, we've broken through this down channel and now exposes the target of around... 42 and a half if I bring that in you'll see it clearer it's where these peaks and troughs are a bounce should be seen from this level however if 42 and a half doesn't hold then we're looking lower down towards the 39 and a half to 40 dollars a barrel any up challenge now should find resistance around 44 dollars well that's a wrap thank you very much for listening and I hope you enjoy your day